Hello and welcome to the next update of the metacognitive approach that we are adopting as a school in order to help raise progress and attainment for all of our students. Last week, metacognition was introduced to you. This week, we're going to look at a metacognitive technique based around self-quizzing that will make your child's self-quizzing more effective. Years seven to 10 do self-quizzing every night as part of their homework. However, in order to make it more beneficial and aid progress and attainment, it needs to be done with a clear metacognitive strategy. Year 11s might want to apply this to their revision. Last week, we looked at the metacognitive regulation cycle of plan, monitor and evaluate. And we're encouraging students to apply this to their self-quizzing. In each of the phases of the cycle, we are asking the students to do three things. In the planning phase, we need to have a strategy that will be beneficial to our learning. And the strategy that we are asking all students to adopt is this. Firstly, the student must carefully read the lines from their knowledge organiser or the content of their revision guide or notes. Then they're required to highlight the key bits of information that they want to learn or remember, as you can see from the photo on screen. Finally, they will need to reread the information to make sure the highlighted content is the most important bits of information. The monitoring phase involves the students attempting the learning task whilst reflecting what is going well and what maybe isn't and needs changing. For the self-quizzing technique, the student should turn over their knowledge organiser or revision guide or notes so they can't see them. They then need to write down as much of the content or information as they can remember. And if they can do that in their black pen. Throughout this phase, they should be thinking about which areas they have remembered well and which areas need more attention. The final phase of the strategy is the evaluation. So this is what has gone well and what needs more attention in order to improve. So during this phase of the technique, they should relook at their knowledge organiser or a vision guide to see what they have remembered accurately. And they can tick what they've remembered well. Then they need to write in green pen what they didn't remember, or if they've made any mistakes, they need to correct for, so that it's accurate. They should be thinking about what they did well and what they would need to do differently next time. They should then repeat the process paying particular attention to the bits that weren't remembered. Okay, and as a reminder, the self-quizzing should take a minimum of 45 minutes per day. So in tutor times, tutors will be checking that this technique has been followed accurately and that the students have really tried their best with their homework tasks. Okay, completing approximately 45 minutes a night. Thank you for your support. And in the next few weeks, a different technique will be being introduced, not only to the students, but to you as parents and carers. Thank you.